welcome to Grace Today, a daily vlog designed to encourage you and equip you with the Word of God. Let's begin. All right, friends, today as we think on what we learned this past Sunday from Exodus chapter 20, verse 13, and the command against murder, as I began with this past Sunday, uh, it's quite obvious we don't live in a time, in a, in a culture that values life. As, as this passage shows us, and really the whole Bible shows us, uh, God does value life. He created man in his own image, and then therefore every life is valuable. So we see that in the, the blessing of the creation, but we also see that here in the, the negative of this command, the fact that it is against God's law to murder, to take life unjustly. Um, but we don't live in a culture that reflects that. So as we think about how we apply this, how we think through this truth this week, uh, the obvious thing is don't murder, right? It's very obvious. But let me encourage you, spend some time today praying uh, for those in leadership in our culture who don't value life. Pray that the Lord would bring them to repentance, that the Lord would raise up new uh, leaders or or um uh, call these leaders to repentance and cause them to change their ways and that they would begin to pass laws that reflect his righteousness and his va God's value of life. Uh, we have a culture that uh, really celebrates death from the movies we see to the laws that we pass. And if that's ever going to change, it's going to take revival. It's going to take a work of the Lord. So let me encourage you, spend some time today praying for that work of the Lord, that he would change particularly the leaders in our culture and their heart towards uh, the innocent, towards the unborn, towards uh, life in general, that they would begin to value life and guard life the way God has uh, called for government to do. Spend some time today praying for government officials specifically with regard to their value of life. I pray this encouragement to you, blessing to you, and hopefully, Lord willing, we will see fruit from this in our society. I love you, Grace Community, and I'm praying for you. Have a great day. Thanks for tuning in to Grace Today. For more information on Grace Community Baptist Church of Elgin, Texas, and how you can support this ministry, check out the links in the description below. See you tomorrow.